Steph, what were your thoughts on the play where GP2 got injured by Brooks? Uh, Steve just said he felt like Brooks broke the code, the player code. What were your thoughts? It was kind of out of line in terms of defenseless player going up for layup and him taking a huge windup and everything that everything bad that could have happened in that situation did knock him out of the game. And you'll see what happens with uh, his injury. It's obviously a tough way to start the game, but um, you know, we'll see what happens. Obviously, it was definitely <laughs> Talk about flagrant twos, definitely one of those. So made the right call there. But um I feel bad for GP. Like this is his time to to shine in a series like this. A play like that knocks him out. So it's tough. Steph, you were right there and you immediately waved over. I mean, you could tell, I guess, immediately that was problematic for, for GP two. I was more so making sure well, I was everybody was frustrated about the play. Um GP's tough, so when you see him in pain like that, you know it's not something light. So, tough situation. So, what happens in the huddle after that? What happens when you guys are t are you thinking about that? Are you are you mad? Well, where does the emotion go after something like that happens? It was like eight zero at the time, so we're obviously trying to get settled in the game. That play happens, it uh, pisses you off. You have a reaction. You understand there's. 45 minutes left in the game, you got to kind of try to settle back in emotionally. And we did a really good job until the fourth quarter where uh, we just had some boneheaded turnovers. My, myself, you know, when I, when I got back in, two turnovers leads to two threes, gets them life. We come back with the lead. And then I know we got to look at our shot selection in terms of making them really guard us, especially if we don't have – the three ball going, like we really tried to force it to happen tonight. And uh, you, you can live and die by that in terms of, you know, hoping that the the dam opens up at some point and it obviously didn't for us. So we got to understand how to finish a game if we're not shooting the ball well with the type of shots that we're trying to get. Seven of 38 from three.